Hey you guys, it's Brianna here and I am here to talk about my makeup bags that I am bringing to Hawaii. So the first one that I am bringing is this one and this is from a Miss to Mrs. box and this one is from an Ipsy bag. So I'm gonna go ahead and go through all of this and I hope you guys enjoy this video. And while you are probably watching this, I am probably in Hawaii. So I'm going to Maui by the way, I don't know if I said that. So the first thing that I have in this bag, this is more of like my essentials bag. This has like my brushes and some skincare items. So that is what is in here. So the first thing that we have is a Ciate London Watermelon Burst Hydrating Primer. This was a little sampler and I wanted to use it while I was traveling since I am gonna be on a plane. I have the Mario Badescu Mini Sage and Orange Blossom Spray because I love Mario Badescu but I cannot bring my huge one that is the rose water so I have my orange and sage one. I also have this which is probably gonna go in my travel carry on my book bag and this is the Neutrogena makeup remover cleansing towelettes and there are seven in here and I'm probably going to be buying some more when I get to Target in Maui. The next few makeup things that I threw in here are a lip cream. This is from NYX and this is in Istanbul. It's like a baby pink. This is the Essence Make Me Brow. This is a brow fiber kind of gel. That's what I have on my brows today. I have like my favorite mascara that I have on my eyes today, and this is from Thrive in Bryn. It's B-R-Y-N-N, Bryn. And then I also have a backup for eyebrows. This is a Avon stick uh, eye brow pencil. There you go. And then the rest are all makeup brushes, and they are dirty because I have not cleaned them yet. So this is the powder brush from Farah. This is a Firma brush, which is a blending brush. This is a Lancome, Lancome blending brush. This is a Fera kind of blending brush. This is a e.l.f. highlight brush. This is a Fera eyelid brush. This is a Fera mini tapered brush. And then this is a Luxie brush. I love Luxie and this, I'm using this as a bronzer brush. And then the next bag is from Ipsy, and I love the palm kind of leaf pattern. It's very trendy right now, and this is just perfect. So what I have in here are like eyeshadows, powders, and foundations and stuff, so let me get everything out of here. So I'm probably gonna fake tan my body, so I have a couple of foundation options, and I'm sure my Fake tan will eventually rub off, so I have some options, so if I need a blend. So the first foundation I have is the Rimmel London Stay Matte Liquid Mousse Foundation in Porcelain Ivy. And then the next one is the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue Hydrating Foundation Stick, and this one actually is SPF 25, and I am in vanilla when I am tan. So it's really nice. I've used it a few times, like if I was out in the sun, so I feel like this is a good foundation. So those are two, those are both compact. And then I do have a concealer. This is the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. And this is a dupe for the shape tape. And you can see how big the wand is, the doe foot applicator. This is the highlighter that I'm bringing. This is the Physicians Formula Butter Highlighter. And this is in champagne. It smells quite delightful. And I've already hit pan on it and I love it. I have two powders that I'm bringing with me, two face powders. I have the Bare Minerals, which has SPF, and this is my darker color. This is the medium beige. And then I have the Maybelline Fit Me in 120, and this is my lighter kind of shade. I also have a Pacifica Bronzer and Blush Duo, and I have it in Rose and Coconut Infused with a mirror on the back. And then the last thing that I am bringing, like I said, this is not a lot of stuff. This is the Dream Big Tarte Palette, and I received this in an Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. And this literally has so many options of eyeshadow, if you could see. Just so many different options. And I'm actually wearing a couple of the colors on my lid. I'm actually wearing All In and all in you can and risk taker. So I'm wearing this red, this gold, and this shimmery champagne color. And I feel like I could wear this in Hawaii if I went out to dinner because I kind of do want to do the natural look. 
Anyways, that is what is in my makeup for Hawaii. Very simple. I don't think you should overpack makeup. I think you should just be simple because most of the time you're not going to even wear that much makeup because you're going to be enjoying yourself on the beach. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to y'all later. Bye.